Okay, now we are back. So I have just moistened my black bean burgers. I've moistened them. I added a little cornstarch. I added a little flour, cake flour. And I am going to now take this mixture, which is my black bean and chickpea patty and cook it. So what I'm doing first, I added a little water because if it's too crumbly, then then it'll just fall apart. So I add a little seasoning. I add a little water. And now I'm going to sear them and put them in the oven. So I take this. What are you doing? Just looking for did you do any more fries i'm doing some now but you can have these i don't i don't eat shrimp oh i'm surprised i've never ate shrimp. okay chris i've never in your life at long john silvers i've never ate shrimp they're always got fish what's up butch what's up dc thank you thank you thank you so Finishing my black bean chickpea burgers. I've just shaped them and now I'm searing them. And I like to sear them in. Okay, Zan, I feel you. I like to sear them in. What's up? What's up? What's up? Yeah, I don't. I don't eat any of that. However, I'm. Whatever works, it works. So I sear them in uh, sesame oil because it has a nice nuttiness. And I feel it never looked good to me. Yeah, they used to look good on the commercials, but I haven't eaten any of that stuff in several years. So I was on live before, but then everyone came into the kitchen and started picking out what I was eating. So I made black bean chickpea burgers. I added panko breadcrumbs a little cake flour i know i wish they all could be but there's beautiful people everywhere in the world trust me i've been all around the world and i yeah yeah and i've met them all <laughs> um but there is something with the california girl i have to say uh it's something with our sunlight and um everywhere has a specialness to it so i will not label anyone lacking because we all have some sort of specialness to us so the burgers are going right in the oil to be seared i will sear them on both sides And then I'm going to start on my fries again. Yeah, so they're black bean chickpea burgers. So I smashed up a can of black beans, chickpeas. I added, I always add liquid smoke because it gives a nice smoky flavor. No, Naj, this is one of your houses, but it ain't your house. Naj, I, I will make you a moderator if you're going to stick around. I really appreciate that. Um, but I know all 268 people in the live are going to be positive and uplifting because that's I'm, what I'm about. Hi, Najee. Okay, keep Thank you, Kip. Keep he eating healthy, Queen, and I am beautiful and don't change. Uh, thin. I think that means a thing. Um, I'm not planning on changing anything aside from stuff I'm not going to tell you about. So that has been uh, the black bean veggie burgers are searing. I sear them on both sides and then I throw them in the oven. But now I'm going to start on my fries. It's okay, Kip. I got what you said. I got what you said. I know you're laughing at my sister in the bed. 
it's 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 always fun here to all 332 people in the lab this is nothing but love and laughter this is why i can show up what's good live <laughs> this is <laughs> thank you sean uh you see this is why i have this positivity because i got she's hilarious i know you can she's here all night i no, guess no i'm not i'm going home she's going home tracy can i get one of your um uh, bean burgers first yeah but they have to go in the oven they sear on both sides and then i put them in the oven so that is great right i know with the olive oil yeah but i we wish it was rosemary oh you have balsamic can yes. i have some yeah it's up there so I'm going to serve my fries. Watch out. This is hot, hot, hot. I'm going to let it cool. I was making thank you, Tracy. And thank you. You got, yeah, I got a lot of sisters. I have a boatload. If anyone would, don't want to, to meet a sister, <laughs> I'm here to say I have a lot uh, of your picking of, uh, uh, of no. all sorts of uh, all differences, but all beautiful in the same way. However, I'd like to say uh, that's it. So, fries are next. Okay, Tracy, that's enough laughing. I, you want a sister? Okay, Chris? Okay, you want I'll, a sis. You get a sis. <laughs> it doesn't matter where you're from. It's where you at. And I'm under the belief that it, it you don't even get to choose where you're from, so it doesn't mean... You wish they all could be what California girls? I know. But Is there anybody from down south, like Houston Poss area? Possibly. Uh, any? Tell your sister she is dressed conservative. Good look, Queen Kip. There's nothing wrong with you, this. Sure, there is nothing. However, <laughs> to insinuate that uh, a woman is higher on some hierarchy because of the way that we dress. I would often say that that has more to do with you and the implementation of patriarchy. Oh my God! So, Alabama's in the house, Alabama. Houston's in the house, Houston. VA counts. All I right. like to say VA is the beginning of the South because I live there. It is. So, all, uh, Alabama, Alabama, what's up? Okay, what's up Alabama? Please. I'm going to be in the Houston area in September. Checking in to pop it up. What's up, Ohio? What's Ohio? up, Atlanta? What's okay. up, Maryland? We got ATL. Oh, we got some Maryland. You could uh, what, Chicago. The D Ohio? is the DMV in here. Yes. Excellent, Alabama, Chicago in the house. All right, all right. That is awesome. I came from work. Her line of work doesn't require this type of attire. Shy Town, I see you. Toledo, I see you. You have a really good crowd. Of course, I'm only the best. Oh my God. Only the best. You could be a news reporter with that voice. Who, me or no, both Hope? Both of us, we all sound the same. I don't think I sound anything like her. I just want the record to reflect. California in the house. Detroit, what's good Detroit? Yeah, roll Tide, Roll. Roll Tide is Alabama U. Oh, that's Alabama U? Yeah. Okay. You look like you have strong, clear voices. We do. Born in uh -huh. Shy, raised in New Orleans. Oh, okay. you know, I just came back there from the Essence uh, Music Festival, which was fantastic. Probably one of the best that I've ever attended. Shy Town raising the, uh, I like Okay. But honestly, I don't know if she had anybody taste test, but um, I was gonna try and knock on her cause she had this bread like raising for two days, but no lie, it's really good. It's rich. You can taste the olive oil and the onions, but it's not overpowering. Um, tastes better than the Italian restaurants that I go to. That says more about the Italian restaurant. Uh, all I'm saying is this is really <laughs> good. It says more about that. I gave 30. Thank pounds. you for making me feel better. Oh, you're welcome. Hope is over here getting surgical with it. 
I gained 30 pounds hanging around her. Yep. I don't want to hang if that's the cost. It's, it matters about how you feel. Because I make the best food, okay? Emma, term pine. <laughs> you could go ahead and uh, entertain. Okay. So, um, an update. I just put the focaccia warm sisola. It, it definitely does. Because I was like wanting to hit her because I can't talk on the phone. First you would were going to cause me physical harm because you can't that sounds like a personal can i be problem. facetious no i, I don't can't know be the facetious difference. okay and i'm a pacifist so i don't play with physical violence <laughs> hmm. okay yeah it does taste good so i will mm. give you two of the burgers to go okay so after you sear them, then you put them back in the oven. How long are you putting them in the oven for? Don't know, probably about 20, 30 minutes. Wow, that's a long time. Yeah, but to who, 20, okay, sure. You're both so pure of heart. I would agree. All you have to do is fast from 6 a.m to 12 a.m. and have a six hour eating window. That is correct. That is yeah. I don't like to eat till noon. And then about seven o'clock I stop eating. What do you do for work? Well, I am a litigation coordinator for a prison here in California. And I handle all the civil litigation uh, that comes through anytime anybody wants to file a lawsuit against the prison, the warden. Um, so I handle and facilitate all of that. It's kind of interesting. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. Oh my gosh. I'm seeing a whole lot more people have joined the live. Mm -hmm. Wow. You, oh, yeah. who? Hi, Andrew. What's, What's up? That? Are you in LA yet? That's a stylist oh. friend from Maui. From Maui? Oh, okay. Yeah. It says hello from Maui. Yes. Yeah, Maui Andrew. is so awesome right now. Yeah. Yeah. That's Hi, that's what's him. up, Andy? Hi, okay. Stephanie. This is my sister. One How? has hair, one does not. <laughs> it's just that you cut it off. It's just an accessory anyway. A correctional officer, big up for all the law enforcement people in here. That's right. I did correctional officer for years. Yes. Yes. Big up. It's a most unappreciated job when you are doing it right. Okay. When you're doing it right. right. Well, you know, in, in my line of work, like I make recommendations for inmates uh, for resentencing. Um, uh, the attorneys and judges ask me for, you know, um, should this person should still be locked up? I'm. That's a good thing to get somebody out. Refer them to job training. I know people who own businesses that um, hire um, uh, former inmates. Uh, I think it's a good thing. I don't think that prison necessarily has to be a negative for some people, right? So you want to use that time to be creative, to be uh, better yourself, and then put you in a position where you could be successful when you get out. You know? Ooh, a correctional officer for 33 years. You go, Ronnie. I've been doing it. It's my 17th year next month. I'll have 17 years. A long time. I didn't even think I'd live. I never thought I'd work there that long. I just thought I'll just work here for a minute and then I'll go somewhere else. Wrong. I mean, I don't. I don't even know why I would think that. But I, you know, made some promotions and I don't have to work. See, my husband's company hires ex-con. That's a beautiful thing, right? Because if someone has paid their debt to society then um, they need the opportunity to redeem themselves in society 
can't hold it against them now. Prisons have to be reformed, yes. Look at Rikers in New York. Now, you know what, it's interesting because I have been watching, I watched a couple documentaries on um, Rikers. It does need to be reformed. Um, what I would say is that California offers a lot of rehabilitative programs and job skills. Uh, so much to the fact you can leave with your union card in uh, electrical uh, wiring for a home, um, a framing, anything building with the home, plumbing, masonry, we offer um, training programs so you can have your union card by the time you leave prison. But um, yeah, rehabilitation, most definitely. Yeah. Most definitely. I, I mean, I think when you think of California, you don't think, oh, they are reformed in prison, but they actually have some really, really good programs um, when people are ready, because not everybody's ready to change, right? So we got to take people out as they are, when they are. <laughs> Encourage more viewers to share. That's awesome. California has always been more progressive. In some ways, but not in all. In some ways. Some things are great, and in, in other ways, it, it still hasn't changed. Compared to what? Well, compared like, to what? Like in New York. New York, especially when it comes to Rikers. Rikers doesn't offer a lot of programs for education. Yeah, but you're saying for education. I'm saying what People say California is super progressive, okay. but... We were the first. We were one of the first states to um, get rid of affirmative action. That happened over 20 years ago. But we're a progressive state. I'm, trying to find the bread that I was just I'm going to see what program Shy has. No, no, that's not. Don't think they have much. And and see, that's the problem. Because what if somebody does want to change? I don't want him running up in my house. Let me get him equipped so he can okay. do what he needs to do. Um, no, but we're I think. About to cut this. Okay, she's about to cut it because she's got. She needs to cut it. Okay. So I think the bean burgers are in the oven. <laughs> What's wrong? They're bean burgers. Let me see it. They want to see it. <laughs> Where? No, the bean burgers. They don't want to see uh -huh. the bread. Somebody, you know, as I every time I talk to you, somebody over here is sneaking all of my balsamic vinegar and olive oil. So when I turn around now, the plate is almost dry. Who would do such a thing? We're so better start a TikTok. <laughs> Maybe. They like the Bean burgers, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hope is dope when it comes to bean burgers. <laughs> bean burgers, you know. <laughs> all healthy I'm vegan they sound good they are everything she's preparing right now is well, all vegan well <laughs> oh I'm lying I okay use butter and she lot. used I'm butter not, I'm not a vegan I'm not a vegan okay I like butter I'm not a vegan I like <laughs> butter <laughs> what is Sam doing every time Sam laughs you got me around this house what's well, wrong what's wrong with your neck going like this. I don't know. You. Something ever since I left you, my neck oh. has been rotated the same Yeah, what well, took her to the gym trying to work it, get that uh, thickness. Well, listen, we don't want to show that. Listen. Uh, yeah, we now, don't need to show it. Are we showing assets? <laughs> oh, you're showing guns. Okay. We could show it all. I'm oh, a finished uh, person. Wait, that's not, that's not the, the type gym. of live this is. It's not that type of live, Hope. That's my life. We had a great time at the gym. We did have a great time at the gym. I took her to the gym. Not only do you have to have a healthy mind, a healthy body, but you have to work you out. Shot glass in there. Somebody's trying to take a shot. Is anybody else trying to take a shot tonight? It's not I don't. <laughs> Where the, <laughs> ain't no, but I, I do not consume alcohol, but I'm a, I, I, I encourage have such a wholesome, if you do. Drink the best. Don't drink nothing cheap. What's up, Serenity? Serenity. This is my older sister, Serenity. Alcohol is poison. Okay. It is. It is. 
Who's taking that shot? Andrew said, take a shot. Who wants to take a shot? Okay. And Let's do it. What y'all taking a shot? What are we taking a shot at? Oh, well. Not a, what is that? This is cannabis. Yeah, I'll take a oh, shot. Oh, I'm not that. taking a shot of that. You don't, you don't have like a shot of like tequila. Mm-hmm. What's up, handsome? Who's handsome? That's handsome. Oh, that's handsome. Handsome was trying to take me to the uh, Cracker Barrel. There's something ridiculous you cracker said. Cracker Barrel is good. I would never eat there. Handsome, I like Cracker Barrel, but I really like Papa Do's. He said, <laughs> I know, don't take her seriously. <laughs> Waffle House. There we go. Hey. I'm not going there either. I like the Waffle House, especially around three. If you know, you know. Catfish always gave me food poisoning. Not, not for me. When I went to Houston in June, um, I had the, some of the best catfish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Papa Do's, if you know, you know. Papa Do's isn't that great. It doesn't have to be great to you, Hope. Yeah, but for exactly. some of us, that's we it like is. it. It's for some Exactly, that's a lot. You can always catch me at the Papa Do's in Houston off the Katy. You know, you know. Catfish are bottom feeders. How good is In N Out? In N Out is good. It's but not I as great as my burgers. It's it's bean good. burgers. Or any burger. I'll make a great beef So In N Out is really good, but like I, I would say that maybe we're kind of spoiled because we have it all the time. So it's not like No, we don't not me. Well she doesn't, but it's here. I don't eat there all of the time. But I think the benefit is like the meat is never frozen. The vegetables are sliced every day. And um everything is fresh. The bread is cooked, all of that. So it's a different taste. It's not like it, it's you can't compare it to like a McDonald's. It tastes nothing like In that. And out is open My husband's a chef, and I can't eat at places but Papa Do's. Yeah, exactly. I wouldn't. She said she loves Papa Do's. Is fine. I know. Sure, sure. I'm she bougie. I, Who's bougie? I I'm hope. I don't even know what that word is, but I'm hope. So what's I don't. What's your favorite? What's fast up, food? James? What's, what's good, food. James? Um, fast food restaurant. I don't eat fast food, so I don't know. Um, if I were to eat fast food, it would be Shake Shack. Okay. I'm getting into the Smash Burgers right now, and I'm really trying to go back to Houston to try a Trill Burger. It's just right there. Just go. They don't have one here. No, I said Houston. It's not. Uh, they just opened it. Maybe well, two months ago. Yeah. Fast food. I don't do a lot of fast food. Shake Shack has the best chicken sandwich. Shake Shack has the best mushroom burger. Mushroom burger. She said that Shake Shack has the best. Hey, my dog's name is Bougie. I don't even, that's some, <laughs> what the kids use. I'm just me. If you call me Bougie, you probably couldn't stand beside me anymore. Is it vegan? Okay, um, we're not at. My moderators can answer that. Oh, okay. Hope, is your sister. Is this your sister, Faith or Serenity? Oh, so, no, you mean Charity. Charity already left. I'm neither of those. I'm Priscilla. <laughs> That's so fair. She is not Serenity, okay? Serenity is my uh, name. Is, is that. <laughs> Is that faith or serenity? No. I have ever met faith. Oh, uh, is the mushroom burger vegan? Yes. Yes. I love those names. Me too. Thank you. Serenity is in the live. She's okay, my Serenity neighbor. is here. She's my neighbor. And okay. My... Okay. Okay, so I let these. So now she's done sprinkle with fresh. Fresh salt. salt, yes, fresh salt. And I want to say that's sea salt. Yeah, nice, good kosher salt. You can have, now they're home fries, because they got- Home fries. Uh, now, I will start with our, ve- our 
bean burgers are going to be served on the focaccia. She's getting ready to serve you guys with the bean burger on focaccia. So the focaccia is already halfway gone. And it is delicious. We do, we do have a super mama. Thank you. We definitely do. Does Hope eat processed food? No. I eat what I... Again, I don't know these labels. For the most part, no, but I do like a Snickers bar. I'm not going to eat it every day. But I typically will make whatever I eat. So very little will be processed. I do like a donut. That's processed. Glazed donut. No, maple bar. <laughs> maple bar. How big is your burger going to be? This is for me and Sam. Do you want me to prepare you one? Because I mean, I'm going to... Um, I'll take it home. Okay, it's a California bean burger, which means it uh -oh. has avocado. Everything that's like a California burger, yeah, mine is plant-based. But okay. again, if I'm in the south of France, I'm going to have something probably did with you make, Did you make your Chipotle? Um, yeah, it's in the oh. fridge. My and her Chipotle dressing is fire. Yes. So we will top this. Do you want a sautéed onion? Fresh. Okay. Hey, Serenity. <laughs> That's a, I eat a whole plant-based diet. You go, um, turpentine. <laughs> <laughs> I told her to. She had a lot of people. Yeah, there's you yeah. having a thousand people. <laughs> right now, yeah. That's why I'm going up to the TikTok Hi, this is I'm excited to see the bird. I me too. I have not seen him since I started talking to you. So right now I know that's what she said. I need to do that too. Here so I are. just pulled them. I'm excited to see this burger, so I pulled them out of the oven. Well, I'm going to show you how I'm going to prepare it. Okay. So I'm going to take it home. Okay, well, if you're going to take it home, I'll let you prepare it. No, you I'll can bring prepare it. No, because you know, prepare it for the camera. I'm going to prepare me Do it for the ground. Chris, I'm Do going it for the TikTok. You see how the... annoying my sister is. We need the first. Yeah, Andy. I yeah. Oh. Um, you know what, and Andy, I'm going to tell me when uh -huh. you're in LA again, because I know you're coming either this month or next month. But I may be meeting you there. So why don't you make one and I'll take a bite and see? So no, I can do a taste test. <laughs> I want to do. I haven't had your bean burger. How come I can't try that bean burger? Sam. <laughs> We need a bite. Okay. Oh, this is too much. This is too much. Sam, are you having, am I preparing your burger? So now? she's trying to prepare for somebody, but she doesn't want me to take it home. So. Okay, you eat it, then I'll prepare myself one. I'll give you everything you can arrange it out. Why don't you do it for me? Because do it for the gram. This ain't the gram. You, that will take off my analytics. Oh, my bad. Oh do it for TikTok. God. Mom, get out of here. What's you wrong see with my how mom? Much, you see, you see. Okay, I'm gonna hit. You. Okay, Andy, we'll be. In touch. Yeah, we need a first bite impression. Oh I'll do a first bite. Make it for me. I'll do it right. I'm gonna need everyone to hush. <laughs> hush. Everyone to hush. Remember when you, you hear say, all of this? Hush. Okay, so you and just to let you know, nobody's had a shot. No, we're all sober, completely. <laughs> this is so wholesome. I love it. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I, isn't it? It's almost sickening. Almost. Almost. Okay, so you can take some of those. I'm gonna take these off. These are gonna be for Sam. I mean, are you gonna dress my burger for me? You the chef? I can't dress it myself. Well, then the texture changes. I wanted to eat it here. Oh, if you eat it here, yeah, I'll make it for you. Not a problem. Okay. But as a chef, I don't want you to go and then it gets cold, so 
That's Chef Boy R. Hope. I'm Chef Boy R. P. I okay. just want you to know. <laughs> for, for saying word. I'll be there next week. Okay, Andrew, Andrew that's a bet. stylist from Maui. Really? He's another fashionista. As long as Dad doesn't get in the frame. Who's John John? One on one on one on one. They want to add me to the live. No. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> it's it's a no for me, dog. <laughs> it's giving no. It's no. Okay, so I will prepare, and then I will. This will be in my cookbook because I actually have that. Yes. Eating hope with hope. Eating hope with hope. Okay. Good food, regardless of meat or not, just make it taste good. I don't make it taste it's good. Vegan. Make it be seasoned and delicious. I actually like it a little spicy, so can you make sure, you know, you put yeah, that extra special sauce on it? Yes. I'm just, I'm just asking, you know. Some people like it spicy. Not everybody wants it plain. And I don't have any more olive oil in the stomach. Well, you can refresh the plate. No, I'm, I'm, I want you to, to dress the burger so fresh I can onion. try it and fresh. see if it's good. You want a fresh onion? Uh, well, is I, it red? We have red. It's either a fresh onion, a sauté. What's wrong onion, with that onion? onion? Nothing. I'm oh. asking you, how do you want a it? A regular one. Okay. Is this your first burger, Hope? The, yes, this is the first bean burger she has prepared for me. She had never made me anything. That's not true. <laughs> but most of them, <laughs> that, oh. Don't ruin my online persona, please. She has made me some stuff, just not, not a bean burger. I don't know who's getting <laughs> these shrimp. So, do you want lettuce on yours? Yes, or? lettuce. I like pickles, tomatoes. So, and one time, um, the what Hope has prepared for me was a pot of beans. In London, you didn't cook anything for me in London. When did I make beans? I do love making beans. I know. I don't remember when, but okay. <clears throat> it was a long time ago. Okay. So it was pre-pandemic. Oh, well, that was. We have to both do the bite on at the, the same screen. time. Yeah. Okay. Dad enjoyed the bread. Oh, he did. Dad I know said, he did. Did Alicia make more bread? Yeah, and he needs no more. No, this bread is delicious, right, Dad? Okay. Mr. Williams introduced this to the pie. This is really good. This is her Chipotle mayonnaise. I put it on everything. I put it on my salmon when I cook my salmon at home. It is hidden. Excellent. Or as the kids say, it is bussin'. Oh, it's bussin'? That's what the kids say. I don't know. Okay. So give them a close-up. See how airy... So I want to give you a close-up on this, okay? So you want to see how airy it is. The it's very moist. Onion. It has the caramelized onions garlic in it. Confit. Garlic confit. And the thing that I love the most is that it has a really, really good crispy texture that really adds to the overall taste of it. You don't want the bread. You want it to be soft on the inside but have a little bit of crunch on the outside. <laughs> and it has a nice crust of sea salt. Okay. <laughs> it is, it's together already. <laughs> what did it I don't know what did Andy Hope. say. Hope loves the sun. Yes. Are you more of a night person? He sees Which me on one? My bike. He's asking you because I'm on. I know oh. you're from Hawaii. He okay. saw me on my bike. He sees me. No, on my bike. I would say normally. Right about now, I'm usually in the gym, and then I go to bed because I have to be at work early. So I want to go to or work early so I can get out earlier. We calling it a half day tomorrow. 
Yeah. Looks delicious. Thank you. Hope did this. Thank you, Tracy. Okay, Where so right know? now she's um, finely slicing yeah. a white onion. I love fresh onions on a burger, especially if they're thinly sliced. Like if we had a mandolin, that would be so good. Mom but this does, is great. I'm sure. We, we just don't have time everything. to find it. So she's going to slice this onion really thinly um, and put that on the burger. And then right now she's also going to thinly Thick. slice. Well, thicker. Like a bite. You can do it. That's a perfect size. A nicely sliced tomato. It's giving Master Chef episode. <laughs> it definitely is. So I'm not on TikTok. Um, they're saying I need to create one, but I do cooking on my Snapchat. So like last night, we had a potluck for my job, and we were doing taco salads, and I prepared. Uh, my dish was chicken and so I bought some chicken breast put them in the crock pot with a mixture of California chiles New Mexico chiles you want garlic powder and onion Gouda? that's how it's said in the Dutch Gouda? no Gouda please let it all marinate shredded it after an hour and put it back in the crock pot with a can of um, chicken broth and let it reduce all the way down in the morning. My shredded chicken for the potluck was fire and everybody was like, who made that? Who made that? Just a little something something. If you're definitely doing cooking on Snapchat, you definitely need to do cooking on TikTok. Yeah. Okay. That's Maybe confirmation because my other friend said I need to be on TikTok doing my cooking. Okay, so you can't see it, but she's dressing the bread, putting a nice layer of her special sauce, her chipotle mayonnaise. Sprinkle me, main. Thank you, thank you. Now, honestly, is that pot pan still on? Because what I would do, because this has such a high oil content, I would also toast it again, face down, so I get a little crispiness on the inside of the bread. I don't know how to cook. That would be helpful to watch. I know. Cooking is not as hard. You just have to be intentional. Very intentional. So she's plating it. You should have plated it so oh Chris, I will do I'm not that gonna say anything. My, however, just talk to the people. So she just kitchen. wants me to um talk to you. <laughs> yeah. Mmm. Your Chipotle must, uh, mayonnaise is busting again. No, thank you. Cooking on TikTok. Remember, this is cooking hope for hope. Cooking for hope. Thanks. Cooking for hope. Yeah, so there's lettuce. Are you adding pickles? Yeah. Avocado. Avocados are so good. Yeah, and Andy, you have time. Andy's 22. You have plenty of time. Oh, you have plenty of time. But I love to have a chef, and my friends just found a new chef. Because a lot of my friends will get a chef. And then for a Friday or Saturday night, he'll cook our own meal. He'll cook everything, and we sit there and watch them do it and sip wine. It's really kind of phenomenal. It's a great way to learn. She's topping hers off with some no, this is fresh. Yours. Oh, right. how come you gave me the one that broke? What? Nothing broke. Okay. Yeah. Do you want a pickle? Why yes, not? that's good. So 
but all this time I thought she was dressing her burger and this one's mine. No, because that's the chef who prepared the guest's food before you prepared yours. Oh, okay. That will be me watching your cooking TikTok videos, sipping some wine. Of course, that's how we do that. But I love to like get a chef, have them come. So I really love chicken wings. I like to cook them myself, but I had a chef and he came and I had a chicken wing party and I had like four of my girlfriends over and he did lemon pepper, garlic Parmesan. And here's the kicker, the best one. Don't tell anybody. It's only a few of you in here. So I know you guys ain't going to tell everybody, but then he did um, some Hennessy wings. They were so good. Okay. Hennessy chicken wings? You do the, okay. do the bite. All right. So, so let me the... show you the presentation. Let me show you. I want to make sure you see. I want you to look at it. You see it? Uh-oh. Okay. So from this here, you'll see burgers nicely topped. We have avocado, tomato, onion, lettuce, and the bean burger. This bus, oh yeah, you got it. So now, um, this is a pretty um, substantial burger. <laughs> and the bread adds to it. It's just super substantial. So I'm just wondering how I'm gonna be able to handle. Got through life this far. Okay. Chipotle dressing is busting. The bread is good. Now, personally, I usually like, um, oh, it's a little, I, I feel the heat. That Chipotle. You said you wanted a little heat. I, I said a little. You're right. Okay. I want you to be able to see what I'm seeing. Okay. Bread is amazing so we're gonna take a first bite oh some of the avocado fell yep i like everything to fall out that's when you know it's good mm. pretty good texture wise not bad but the flavor profile is pretty good Now, what would you recommend drinking with a bean burger? Whatever you look like. I'm under the assumption. Whatever you. It's I good though. It's alchemy. Whatever you would like. More salt and pepper, and then I'll take a bite. I would like to cover mine in my chipotle. Good. nice cold beer it is very yummy but it doesn't have a heavy feeling so here's hope she's gonna take the first bite look at it you see it you I put a lot of it. avocado on mine avocado and then i'll do the good You're 80s gonna, uh, 90 yeah that one here i don't i'm going to do the she's big gonna bite. do it then the big bite right so Made with love and intentional. That's intentional. right. Intentional. That's so right. You see it. Oh my gosh. You gotta see the crust of the bread and then. Oh my gosh. Mm hmm. Tastes great. Mm hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Good flavor. Some home fries. You can yeah. crumble this up and use this as a taco meat. Yeah, I would do that. But I like mine almost burnt because I like mine more crispy. You can do whatever you want. All right. You, I'm packaging up some for you. None. 
they don't have it there andy i make all my food at home it was pharmacy but pharmacy hasn't been opened i don't go to <laughs> you know maui i maui is a beautiful space however i have a uh, eclectic well well flavored palate since i've traveled and eaten all around the world many michelin starred restaurants and all of these other things however the best thing about maui are our vegetables restaurants the only places i can say that i would tell other people to eat at is um the italian restaurant at the four seasons oh that one is good you never which took is beautiful. me there jennifer's which is a vietnamese restaurant and Wailuku, it's consistently good. Everyone that works there is passionate and funny. Marlowe's, Marlowe's up country in in um, Makawao, and they have some great vegan pizzas. But I'm not, I don't consider myself vegan. I'm plant based, but I'm not. I vegan to me is a lifestyle. Vegan means that everything that touches me has no animal byproducts, meaning my hair dye, my nail polish, my toothpaste, everything. That is not me. So I will never say that I am a vegan because it's a complete lifestyle and that's not how I live. So the Italian restaurant at the Four Seasons, Marlowe's Up Country in Makawao. There's a Mexican food truck on the west side near Kanapali. And that's probably it. <laughs> There's not too many places. And I cook every day. I like cooking. I like the energy I put into my food. Let me take another bite. Mm-hmm. I like Maui pie in Kihei, but outside of that, mm-hmm, yeah. Jennifer's I love, but outside of that, Maui, not too many places. This is what I like. I'm used to doing this, cooking with my family, so I enjoy it. This is great. Just the focaccia is great this is the first time i made focaccia bread and i'm gonna end this live because i'm gonna smash on this mm -hmm. when the food is good we're done with talking no more talk so is there anything else you want to say first because i'm gonna close this out okay uh it was nice meeting you and speaking to you guys you are a lovely audience very insightful so jennifer all of yeah he's talking okay. about okay awesome. bean burger on point try the recipe <laughs> let us know they already have i close all my lives with this be the reflection of love he said lovely meeting you thank you andy be the reflection of love because we all come from an infinite source of love show up show up all you gotta do is show up the rest is already there for you Don't when you like show you up everything. make it look good you know make it show off a little make it look oh, good oh are we showing off a little we yeah. showing off oh okay <laughs> and finally don't be eating no bad food. Most of y'all whipping snappers don't know what good food is. Season your food, eat good food, smile, love yourself, and know that it's always getting better. Because it is. It is. So I'm going to smash on this. I ain't got time to talk to y'all. I got to eat. I love you. If you miss my lives, I come on twice a day. They are all uploaded to my YouTube under the same page. Hope is speaking. Check me out there. There's a cookbook on its way, and you did show up. You did.
Who you did, Andy? Andy. I'll be seeing you. I'm, I'll message you when we get off. Oh, okay. Until then. Hi, Tri Pearls. What's up? I didn't even see you were in the room, but you get to see the family. What's so now good you know. With it, Tri Pearl. Okay. Good night. Bean burgers.